Monash University is preparing to be part of one of Indonesia's most significant infrastructure projects. The university's rail engineers are looking at providing the maintenance and training needed for Jakarta's new mass transport system. Helen Brown reports. Jakarta's traffic is amongst the world's worst. It's hoped a new mass rapid transport system will help ease the daily gridlock. And once up and running, Australian engineers are expected to be doing some vital work. The things that we have offered the other railway systems are practically looking at the maintenance improvements, looking at how to run the operations safely, how to run the operations effectively, in fact cost as well as timely manner. The Institute of Rail Technology based at Monash University does work on transit systems in Hong Kong, Singapore and Dubai. Earlier this year it signed an agreement on the Indonesian project and executives met recently to discuss the collaboration. So the fact that uh, Monash IRT are supporting, are working with such uh, caliber is something important for us to look at and because that comes back to our, our mandate to provide international standard. The Monash engineers are already running condition tests on other Indonesian tracks. It's the first time the cutting edge technology has been used in the country. The engineers would also train the Indonesian workforce with skills transfer considered vital for a project where more than 80% of workers are under 40. So this is an opportunity not only to build infrastructure, but also to build its people. And such collaboration with uh, research institution like this is on the way to do that. The benefit for Jakarta is that they'll be tapping into some of the world's best advice, and uh, if they haven't got it, they'll know where to get it, that, they, that Indonesia could possibly get around the world. And the collaboration with Australian engineers could be just the start, as Jakarta has plans to roll out more urban train systems. Helen Brown, ABC News.